hydrogen pump, this one. Now this potassium hydrogen pump is actually responsible to do the production of the hydrochloric acid that we have discussed in the synthesis of hydrochloric acid. So now what PKB is doing, this PKB, when we indicate that PKB comes and interacts with this hydrogen uh, potassium ion. So here we have two types of the ions. So PKB is actually potassium competitive, okay? So that will actually indicate, when indicated, this PKB will interact with the potassium ions. Now what will happen? This potassium ions, when they are blocked, when they are actually combined with the PKB, they will actually block the uh, potassium hydrogen ATP pump. And the case is obvious. When this pump is blocked, then there will be no more exchange of the ions. So what will happen in the lumen before we were supposed to have hydrochloric acid? Because of this pump, hydrochloric acid was supposed to be synthesized. Now this pump by means of the PK is blocked. So when PK is indicated and that blocks this pump, so what will happen? There will be no any more production of the hydro hydrochloric acid. Acid. So means that acid suppression is actually seen. And this is actually, the PK is actually the novel drug, the newly discovered drug. And this is having way too much, uh, you can say, potency than the uh, PPIs. So when PPIs are not functional anymore, then we actually switch towards the BK, PK. And uh, I hope you got the mechanism. Still, if you have any kind of confusion or question, drop in the comment box. And thank you for watching.